Hey, y'all, just want to get at y'all real quick, man, before I get to running around, man. I want to speak on the Boosie situation. I just wanted to say, uh, y'all going too far with the cool shit. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong, like, you know, go ahead, man, do y'all. You know, y'all want to be killers and dealers and all that. Cool, go ahead and do y'all, right? But it's a price to pay with it. And, you know, I can, I can admit, man, as being a young dude coming up, like a young, young man coming up, and really running around acting like y'all and carrying it like y'all in so many different elements. Shit never worked out right, man. You know what I'm saying? How that shit never worked out right? I'm going to tell you how it never worked out right. At the end of the day, what ends up happening is individuals begin to follow it. You know the pain behind it. You know why you dumping perks. You know why you drink and serve as a recreational thing. Because I ain't really, I'm not a guy, man, like, I'm not with people taking drugs, but I know some individuals that take those medications, man, when they in really, really bad pain or hurt physically, and they work out after it's over with, like after the doctor prescribes, you know, these doctors are liars, so some of them are going to tell you lies like you might not be addicted to it, but guess what, you're going to be addicted regardless, but you have to win yourself down, but usually... You know, a strong brothers, man, after, you know, we heal up. It's like we can put it to the side. I know I've done it a couple of times. But it's those times that you get stressed out more than anything that you don't got nothing to do. And the first thing you do is think about getting high. Nah, you got to think about something else, man. Even though I have been a victim of that numerous of times, man. Listen to me. I done lost a lot, trying to help a lot, trying to put a lot in perspective along with trying to keep a family together and lost that. But listen, I made sure that I got me together. See, sometimes you got to get you together first. I remember my ex used to tell me that, like, yo, you got to get you, got to get ourselves together. And I never looked at life like that. I never looked at life like that. I looked at life like you get past things and, it, and everything will be cool. But in life, I've learned that it's not about that. Each individual has their own pain. How are you going to carry thousands of hands? All right, cool. When you say, damn, I don't feel like wanting to be tired and, you know, with the foamy mouth and all that, what ends up happening is you're going into a seizure. Ah, nut stuff. Some things that we feel like is cool or it's all right. Yeah, I'm going to get me out of my whole everything. You're the same guy when you're sober, just better. And... You don't have to think that I'm talking down because I don't do no talking down, man. You know, I know what I learned about drug abuse is a, it's a disease. A lot of people ain't been through what you, a lot of people ain't been through what I've been through. So I can't tell them what they can do or what they can't do. But what I can tell you, you got to start making a step and they got to start in your head. As long as you cussing yourself out every day in your head, I don't care how much money you're getting. It, the, the, when you're getting a lot of money, though, or a lot of money is around, you have to get an understanding of something. Strength. If you don't get an understanding of strength, what ends up happening is you become weak. You can't be weak. Boosie slid all the way out dollars as a man, you know, honoring his friend. What happens when he honored his own friend? It don't got nothing to do with his main man ops it don't got nothing to do with bootsy man ops somewhere somewhere down the line i feel like a j prince or somebody could come in and and speak on these things and get it together because what's happening is i believe a lot of them looking at him and how he might have ran at a time and said we're gonna carry it like that and guess what i'm sorry to say there is no j princess at the time yeah i've snatched his honor for things that had to do with a lot of different things that I felt wasn't cool, but guess what? You can give a man his honor back. He's not a rat. He's not a rat. He's never been on the stand, right? He's never made a statement and didn't get on the stand. Abortion, he's never done these things. It's honor to be listened to. Maybe we get some things together and it's not about money. No, to come to Philly, to come to Dallas. It ain't about money to come to Jersey, to come to New York. It's not about money. It's about us unifying because guess what? The police going to unify us in a prison cell. You know, we all get unified then. 
Oh, that's my man. Assalamu alaikum. Hey, praise the Lord. Hey, hey, listen, Buddha, I get my stress out during the day. I go in the yard and I clear my head. All of a sudden, when we are enslaved, all of a sudden, while we are enslaved, I know I just was enslaved not too long ago, based off of lies, can in a cell. Of course, I'm here, humbly lie, but at the same token, let me give you an understanding. When I got there, I said, damn, you weak. You weak, his? You weak, you missing it. You missing what people have been telling you. You're arrogant, you're cocky, you're too solid for everything, but now you gotta take the humble approach again in life. Yeah, I like that. See, we enslave ourselves and with, with negativity, the shit we've been through, and we allow them to enslave ourselves too by being in the can. They got control of us then. Mr. Big Bankroll don't got bankroll no more. Bank account, you gotta get somebody else to do that. Who wants to do that from a jail cell? All these bloggers, I see y'all, y'all all over the place, man. You see what y'all doing? Y'all starting confusion with these kids, man. This person going through it with that person. That person going through it with this person. But let me ask you this question. Have you ever thought about that your kids might be watching this? I know my children watch it. We bitch, we laugh because we know my approach. I love the people in the community, though, because they know my approach more than anything. I love it when a young and pull up. Erna, hey, we cool. Listen, just wanted to say, man, you made me feel this way that day, or you touched me this way. But honestly, if I touched you, listen to me. I don't care what you see me do. I'm not one of these frauds out here to play the poster man. I didn't do 30 or 40 and 50 hundred years for no robberies and stuff. I had mouthpieces, alhamdulillah. I had a law, I had God, right? So I wasn't a kid, I've done a lot of juvie bits. You did, because I, you know, I fell. You know, once you fall, you'll be in you study center fighting a case for months. You know, or JJC, places like that, you know, CBDS, or, you know, every which one it was. And guess what? Everybody in my city knows that about me. And I, you know, I got I got an understanding of something though. Once I became a man, I still wasn't a man. I had family that took care of me. Yeah, my family, my parents was on drugs, but I had grandparents that honored me. I chose this. And sometimes you gotta say, Damn, who was my leader? I didn't have a leader. I had a father, but didn't have a leader. I didn't come out of crib every day like, yo, listen, you got to go to this. All I can remember him saying is keep your eyes and your ears open and keep your mouth shut. That's it. I took those three things and I applied them. But sometimes I carried it where as though I felt like my input was the only input that matters. Look at the world we're living in. Everyone is dying. I'm talking to you from a, a place where I didn't care. Like, what's up? Whatever. And I wanted to say something else, too. Alpo the rat. We, we, we'll speak about that. We ain't going to bring this rat here right now. We ain't got time for that. But look, next video, stay tuned. I got some honor I want to speak on. It's going gonna, it's gonna to mess y'all up, but I want y'all to stay on the path that it's on. The path that it's on is great, and I love it. I'm telling y'all. Kinger in a life and direct.